So hello everyone. In this video clip, we will be seeing the recent upgrade, add-ons, features and settings added in the latest India Kit June 2020. So starting with feature definitions. So feature definitions, we have added some new feature definitions which are compatible with IRC codes. Basically, uh, those names the, or the layer names or payment component names which you have been seeing in the codes have now been added so that uh, uh, they are familiar to you and uh, whenever you are going to assign that feature definition to any payment component layer, uh, it will uh, it is going to be reflected the same in your quantity reports so let us see in the main feature definitions region library file what we have added so under this we need to go to this file region lib and under alignment okay so we have added two alignments as you can see and one is master center line alignment second is to india center line alignment so we can select any of it And uh, there are other by defaults which are already provided with Open Root Designer are already present. Okay, so moving ahead, let's see what are the mesh components added. So in mesh, we have three folders which are being named one, two, three, four, uh, just in order to get them on top. So it's very easy to and convenient to drop down while uh, assigning them in your templates so that you need not to scroll down again. And uh, these folders are having layer names like you can find BC, CRMB, Crumb, Rubber, Modified Bitumen, BC10, which 10, VG40, VG30. So all these uh, you can assign, suppose uh, many of our times, in fact, 90% times, we know the viscosity grade of our bitumen. So we even assign, we can assign using this feature definition. So there is hardly any difference between um, VC, VG30 and VG40. And uh, uh, with respect to feature symbology or how it will appear in your 3D, but only the change in naming convention. Next, and next you can see bituminous macadam, bituminous concrete, then dense bituminous macadam and in two different layers. So one, if one cannot find any feature definition name, so he can create his or herself so there are other layers also emulsion foam bitumen premix carpet ogpc open graded prime coat tack coat seal coat so all these have been added while keeping the default components here only yeah so we have not deleted the default feature definition names which are provided with open road designer okay so same is uh, with your aggregates so in aggregates we have added gsb wmm granular crack relief interlayer as well as the filter layer drainage layer as well as 500 compact six subgrade uh, while keeping intact the default ones as well in concrete it can be used for your rigid so if you can see we have um, even assigned the grade of concrete so now you can assign the feature definitions having the concrete grade m like m40 m35 m30 m so right from M5 to M70, we can have the concrete gates also. Why we have done this? In order to uh, just to get your uh, these names in your quantity corridor quantity reports when we extract the detailed reports. Also, we have we do have a payment quality concrete PQC and DLC used in your rigid road construction. Next, also one of the important so payment rehabilitation. So you can find existing payment milling over the BC, BM, DBM and leveling. So this was all about your mesh component feature definitions. Next upgrade what we have done, um, we have uh, assigned or created a new annotation groups for your plan as well as your for profile. So under this annotation group you can see um, under this uh, region library file so if I just scroll down the plan one, so I am having the drawing, the master plan grid and master plan grid color. And for linear, okay, so we have master stationing and stationing India kit. So if you are using stationing India kit, which have been assigned to feature uh, definition of your alignment to underscore India kit, uh, India center or uh, super center, super India center line, so that uh, uh, you can get the proper offsets, offset values of your horizontal curves as well as other parameters so if you see in the profile so in the profile you can having the 
you are having uh, for A1, A2 and with different change intervals. So this is a very much important and most uh, useful for all the design engineers of uh, highways. So main uh, where we or whether other engineers got were stucking earlier in drawing production that um, proper adjustment of sheets and your proper annotation group so they have to create their house uh, themselves so which was a little bit time consuming for them so we have already created for them and uh, they are present here so it uh, all of them have been con configured according to the sheet size so you can see the sheet size name is also written in front of it and different different options so you can find one two three four five six seven eight to ten variants of profile frame profile annotation groups so this was all so we have worked on drawing as well as linear annotation groups of both plan and profile and uh, we have studied almost at least 18 countries data set and uh, the best uh, which we can get or we could extract some uh, good help from them so after that we have edited our own and then assigned your uh, colors to them though like we have edited the uh, feature definition file the feature definition DJ library file for colors and uh, how these colors come since colors are totally dependent on the levels as well as element uh, element templates so we have even modified the levels as well as element template and added the new ones which you can see even the presentation so this was all about your uh, what we have done so far in this and next uh, I would like to showcase the Indian road templates or the typical cross section or the TCS so you can find uh, within Cardos if you go to create template and load the ITL file so you know group of uh, all the templates are present in your ITL file so you need to simply open up that ITL file and you can find within Indian standards template library India ITL so when I when you are going to open this, uh, you are going to have uh, this template library. So 00, 0 are uh, the prefix used for the default uh, libraries available when you install Open Road Designer. So by default, whatever the content is present, so you can we have uh, affix, uh, we have made a prefix to them. So by 00, 0 you understand it's it is a default, and the 0, 01 is all your Indian content. So this is all made based on your uh, by referring your IRC codes, two lane manual, four lane manual, and uh, you can find okay just if I just open Indian templates so you can find three categories undivided, divided, and overlay and widening. So under undivided also you are having too many options. So two lane with closed uh, drain and guard la guard rail. Okay so and this is your another template. And under divided also you can find the four lane templates as well with different options those who want to create a six lane templates can use this four lane template and modify the um, uh, point properties of the or the edge of payment point properties and can set the horizontal offset value or the you know uh, constraint parameter constraint the point constraint you need to increase the uh, from four lane to six lane you need to increase the payment width so by this you can create even your six lane or eight lane or as per required so we do have even overlay and widening so you these templates can be used directly for any overlay and widening project so okay so let 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 me show you uh, something uh, related to the site visibility tool so so site visibility tool under terrain tab if you just load the site visibility you are going to get a method or uh, okay so setting file name you need to load that and uh, within the Indian standard sites visibility folder you are going to get one more XML file Indian SST OSD ID ISD site visibility tables you need to select that and simply open it so while you do this um, you are going to get a method as table and table name here we are going to get three options SST, ISD, OST, as well as you can change the speeds. So, as soon as you change the speeds, the required distances uh, they are going to change, 
as and they are linked to the speed which you are which you have selected so this is coming from IRC 73 1980 manual and uh, they have been configured and uh, integrated into it so you can now even find your Indian site visibility toolkit so next comes very much important that is your drawing production so drawing production has issues have been resolved basically I would not like to say issues but um, you know it's a hustle or um, uh, time consuming customizations which user keep on avoiding or they may be struggling into that so we have now ready made sheet seeds available for them so sheet seeds are basically your A1 and A2 as well as A3 setting which can be used directly so that your plan as well as your profile comes appropriate at appropriate locations in the sheets and they do not get staggered here and there so we have uh, made the settings for all of them by uh, uh, repeatedly testing the offsets as well as uh, the linked annotation groups with them scaling bar everything we have taken care and made ready made for you so under drawing production if you just look out the name boundaries you are going to get uh, place name boundaries and when you just drop down the for civil plan so you are going to have these options as well so earlier um, uh, it, it was a1 plan profile in which uh, there was only plan and uh, simple profile grid without any frame so now if you select this master a1 india kit plan profile plan you are going to get a frame profile as well not just a simple profile grid and uh, okay so we have options for a2 and a3 as well so one we have kept as a on, uh, trial like a2 indicate plan for hill road so you know hill roads have too many curves sharp curves so they require a greater uh, page area so this can be this option can be used for any hill road project in which your one uh, plan will be coming on one page and then profile will be on another page but for that make sure you create right click on the name boundaries and then select create alternate plan profile drawings so we have done this so that it covers a uh, wider area of um, offsets like uh, normal offsets which we have used as 150 meter uh, from center line left and right so but for this we have kept a greater value so it will cover up up to 300 left and 300 right so you can even change uh, as as per your required requirement and then we have a2 and a3 plan 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 profile plan as well as so this is not just simply copied but every individual degen library degen file uh, degen library file has been configured with the proper fonts so that nothing is missed out and we have taken care of each and everything so similarly you can find for your profile as well so if you just drop down so you can see the multiple options available for your profile so in profile we have kept uh, different options as well for uh, like uh, we have kept framed as well as non framed so if you, it's up to you whether you want a complete profile bands or you do not so this uh, by this method also one can find very easy to select as per his choice and you can see the a to indicate profile hill optimized so as I repeated, as I said for the plan, so we have uh, we have uh, just provided this just for as a trial. We can use it for any hill hill road project in which uh, one page completely acquires the plan and another page completely acquires the profile due to sharp curves, reverse curves, and many other site constraints. So I hope uh, this will. Um, make a lot of faces happy to see that because all everything is uh, pre-configured and being provided to you as per Indian requirements so these settings can be even used by any, any team globally even or um, some help can be taken by uh, another product line software like open rail so uh, they can be configured as per requirement using these digital library files okay so as we were saying like uh, we can uh, just have a look on how the drawing sheets will be so if you just see uh, there we have created a different plan and profile sheets so just look just have a look on one of them so it's going to be like this 
so you can see the proper adjustment of your plan as well as your profile so upper part plan below is profile as well as your sheet border so sheet border is completely customizable here it is attached as a cell within your region library file so if you need to change this so you can even change uh, before creating your drawing in the region library file you need to simply attach it as a cell over this uh, one single sheet and it will be copied in all over the sheets which for your project file so if you, if i just uh, have a closer look of the plan grid so you can see that there are these grid lines even with easting and nothing information so uh, along with this easting and nothing information we do have uh, some curve tables as well as some spiral labels as well so everything is customizable if you want to change the order of any curve table you can change it you can even add your speed also um, in this india india uh, sorry in this uh, open road designer latest release 1 2020 you we are having some curve sets even so using them uh, we can do that and this north arrow is dynamic and it's rotating as per your uh, plan direction as well as now you can have this wonderful colored profile bands and which you are having all the values so we have created this for 10 meter interval currently this drawing is made on 20 meter interval but uh, it can be configured the interval can be changed 10 25 even 30 even 40 50 as per requirement so we do have some superlation lines as well but when, once you are going to create you will be getting once you will assign the super elevation you will be getting those super elevation values even right over here so this was all about the updates and um, there these are the, some major updates and you can find some minor updates or minor features added in the com complete presentation so i hope uh, this satisfies many of the users because now uh, the struggling with the drawing production part has been completely waved off using this uh, standard so you can see in this sheet it's a 10 meter interval so how these uh, uh, how these fonts have been auto configured and uh, making best use of your dgen library setting files Okay, so thank you everyone for watching this video and I hope uh, it will uh, increase your and speed up your deliveries by up to 80% and it will reduce your struggling time even by 80%. So thanks all.